Alright, so I'm back with another hair tutorial today. I'm going to be doing um, a simple puff. Well, it's not going to be that simple, but I am going to do a puff because here where I live at, the weather is has been raining a lot. And if my puff get wet, I don't really care. So I'm going to be doing some twists on the side, something a little different in the center. I don't even know what I'm going to do, but I'll figure that out and some um, kind of like check shape twist in the back so I already got it parted off so I'm going to get ready to do it right now
so my battery died I didn't get to show how I did these twists in the front but all I did was I just took them in sections like three sections a piece and twisted it and twisted it until it became like a little knot and I pinned it in place got the next second section twisted it twisted it till I got a little knot and did then did the third one so um so got my twist on the side got my twist going up in the back they're not as neat as I wanted them to be but I was trying to hurry up I'm tired <laughs> but I wanted to get my hair done so um so it'll do so now what I'm getting ready to do is put my puff in so I'll put a little gel on the side and while I do that I'm pushing in my bobby pins and I'm gonna get my little twisty tie double it around so that it's tight pull it up over my twist in the front and slide it up a little bit in the back so to catch that hair that's coming out of those twists back there okay and then flip it out And probably what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to twist my puff, two strand twist it, so that um, it'll have a little texture to it. And that'll look even better with um, my twist. Yeah, but I really like it. Hopefully I didn't do it too high in the back. Probably could have did it a little bit lower, but... good so far. Alright, so that's the do. That's the side. That's the back. That's the other side. And the front. Hope you like it. And I'll come back.